Welcome to YouTube Celebrity Gossip News with me and Tommy. How is it going, Tommy? It is going fantastic, Chris. And tomorrow I'm going to Gosa in St. Joseph, Missouri, and it will be a place called the Batine uh, Mansion. Nice. Is this mansion supposed to be big? Or go into detail about this mansion a little bit. Uh, it's a pretty old mansion that's been in the area for over 100 years. It's not super big, but also it's not super small either. It's about, I'd say, well over 500 square feet. Nice. Well, um, that's good. So you're going on a ghost hunt. We're going back to Portland and we got some YouTube celebrity gossip news. So let's go to work and here we go. everybody um, basically um, we have some news to share with you so Tommy um, let's talk about what you have to share what do you got for us this week okay Ingrid Nielsen who is a big youtuber in the beauty world uh, and vlogger and lifestyle uh, personality has recently come out with a collab with the beauty company known as fresh who she's been using for a long time. She promote, she talked about it in all her videos and stuff. And she was in 2016 uh, at the 25th anniversary of the company's uh, time being around, 25 years, where she started off the kickoff to uh, passing on the idea to the people who own the company about doing a collab with them eventually. Uh, a couple years later, uh, they get into contact with her. They start talking about, you know, how what the package look like everything all that and the whole process and now it's dropped the packaging will include her walking her dog so uh, part of this process has been designing the uh, the packaging for the product which will be the Brooklyn skyline but not your typical Brooklyn skyline like as for a tourist we'll see no it'll be for someone who's lived in the city for a long time which she currently lives in New York City right now because she used to live in LA but she's moved to uh, New York so the it's all part of this uh, sugar in the city slash sugar lip treatment, which is the uh, brand that they're uh, using under the Fresh brand. And it's a blackberry shade. And so that's all the packaging. And so she's been in contact with the Fresh Cup for over a year. You'll be able to buy it and now that it's launched in Fresh stores and Sephora stores, as well as both of their websites. And it'll be $24. Now to help promote this launch of the collaboration with Fresh. She'll be hiring product all over uh, the city of New York via Instagram. So for fans can uncover and check out these products and tell other people about them. So what's your thoughts on that? Well, that's good, Tommy. Success never uh, goes away unless you know what you're doing. And so basically, this is a really good thing to have for Ingrid. What about this product makes it so special? Uh, it's because she had uh, her say in um, every step of the way on what would go into it, the packaging. That's what makes it so special. She had uh, 50 50 you know is 50 50 in the whole making of the product right so those of you that want this product can go down to the description down below we will put her um, link in the description down below so you can watch her videos and you could check out what the product we're talking about is and stuff and those of you that want this product um, basically can check that out and I have to say within Greg keep up the good work on what you're doing um, keep up the awesome job just because you're getting a lot of success. This is not her first collaboration. She's also did collabs with Bare Minerals and CoverGirl. And I, in the earlier days of VidCon, 
I did meet her. This is back when before she broke up with Luke Connor. I did meet her briefly upstairs, you know, where they have all those uh, meeting rooms, and she's a really oh. nice person. Right, yeah, I, mean, I remember running into her myself, and uh, she's a pretty awesome person. Um, she's really nice, though. Those of you that have never been to VidCon, I recommend that, you know, she goes every year. She may skip a year or two, or, you know, she may go to another one and stuff, but like me and Tommy are saying, she's awesome. Um, you can get a lot of ideas, talk to her about her channel, and if you don't know who she is, Tommy, um, what do people do uh, they can go check out her channel and look down below and you can find out more about her right so all right so moving on Tommy well okay so here's some big news I want to talk about mr. Cody Lee mr. Cody Lee is a senior musician and he has addition for America's Got Talent I've been there right Tommy but mm -hmm. we won't we won't go into that we're focused on Cody Lee right now so Cody Lee has um, shot the world why because he's autistic who cares it's not stopping him but he's doing some really awesome things he is blind and autistic but that is not stopping his dream the judges like him the audiences like him he is really awesome he's got great vocal range he has great range all together when like I said uh, Simon Cow likes him um, the judges like him how we moved out like some I mean he has had a lot of views of um, his addition on America's Got Talent and he's doing great um, like I said the things that people are pointing out about him that he's blind um, if you don't know who he is I'm going to put a link down um, on the bottom and you guys will know who he is what he's about what he does and the kind of talent that he has. That is amazing that despite his disability, he's not letting that, you know, get him down. He's not listening to other people saying, oh, this about him and that about him. He's focusing on the positive stuff in his life and what he's good at and what he can do with his voice and uh, everything. It's just amazing how he's ignoring all the negative people in his life and listening to those positive people and turn that negative into a positive. Right, because there's a lot of negative people out there that would be like, okay, you're, you know, this, 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 and this, and this, and you don't need to be additioning. You just need to be sitting at home and doing nothing or just be around family and let them sing and, and stuff. But, you know, it's Cody Lee that has opened the door for people out there that, you know, that are not getting judged, like if you're artistic or whatever, um, to open up that door and, you know, addition for a television show like America's Got Talent. I'm sure there's American Idol, and I'm sure that there's a heck of a lot more out there, but like you said, Tommy, he's not listening to that negative impact. He's listening to a lot of great things out there, and that's what I like, and I like how he presents himself. I like how his brothers, his mom, his sister, his dad are, and it, you know, supporting him and stuff and letting him do his thing so and I like the little talks that you know his mom gives Cody when just before he additions but he's on stage as such as at a piano or something she's just like you know this is your time you deserve it here we go anyways that's all the news that we have we will put some links down on the description down below so you guys could take a look at it uh, we will be headed to Philadelphia next week for Comic-Con. We will be covering quite a bit, right, Tommy? Yep. And we will be showing you some great, great stuff. Don't forget to subscribe. Keep on watching and like the video. Anyways, we will see you guys later and bye. Bye.